story has so many people asking, how in the world does a plane just vanish? News 8's Josh Scheinblum spoke to folks over at Chester Airport about how this could happen. Since man learned to fly, it's not unlike driving a car. Airplanes have been on the move. And at Chester Airport, it's a mode of transportation pilot Bruno Kitka says is central to his charter plane business. I've been doing this professionally for just about 40 years now. But with flight comes risk. If I was flying along and I hit a bird, there might be some dents in the aircraft. Case in point, it was just days ago a Malaysian jet carrying more than 200 passengers and crew lost contact with air traffic controllers, leaving some to expect the worst and raising questions as to what occurred. And at this point, we can only speculate what happened to that plane, but Bruno says what could likely be explained is how it disappeared. Well, an airplane can basically disintegrate in the air. Uh, why would that happen? A number of reasons. It could be something catastrophic that happened on board the aircraft. As we know, some aircraft have bombs on them, they get blown up. Once that airplane disintegrates and it becomes pieces, radar won't pick it up anymore. And with no radar to track its location, a plane can appear to have vanished. It's hard to say why that airplane dropped off of radar. I think only further investigation is going to show up or show why that happened. We may not yet know where Malaysia Airlines Flight 370 is, but Bruno insists people need to remember. Flying is still one of the safest ways to travel. People want answers, but you know what? You can't give anybody an instant answer. In Chester, Josh Scheinblum, News 8.